at the time I left my company, I had six children and the youngest was only about five months old. There's mm-hmm. a lot of reasons to be afraid, right? How am I going to provide? Where's it going to come from? Yeah. But once I can release myself from that fear and trust God and trust that through that agency, I'm going to be able to unleash places of even greater impact, mm-hmm. then I'm really not afraid. And so I think that the fear part and then the agency part for me is I actually think I'm going to do more impactful and more important things when I'm not tied back to an industry that I'm really not that vested in anyways. I mean, my whole business over 18 years had been built around electricity. Kenny, I don't really care about electricity. Like some people get really excited yeah. about clean energy or innovative products or the impact. I, I like the people involved, but I wanted to have something that was more of a calling for my life. And then mm-hmm. since starting this business, my wife and I found out we're pregnant with number seven. So I have even more reason for the fear bucket. Yes, sir. I saw that. Yes. Um, I have more reason for that fear bucket. But for some reason, I feel more in tune with the agency part and the calling part than I even did nine months ago. It only continues to propel itself. So I don't mean to talk so vague. It's more like now I get to be involved in anybody's business as a consultant. I get to launch whatever businesses we want to as practitioners of this operating system. So don't just consult people on it. Let's build brands that live it. Let's incubate other people that we know we we believe in those founders. We believe in their potential products and they just have no place to go. Let's incubate those folks. And then where we can, we're actually making a whole move to buy existing businesses, especially from baby boomers, and then turn around, put our operating system in place and bless 100% of the employees there with an ownership uh, structure that allows them all to have the upside of a successful turnaround or a successful mm-hmm. growth curve without having to chop up the company. 